What are the names of our primary colors? Green, red, green, blue, yellow, orange. Orange is a one. It kind of happened by accident. I was an English major. And then my advisor kept asking, what am I going to do with English? And I kept giving her this one answer, and she thought that maybe I should teach, try teaching. So she advised me to take a couple of classes in the education department, and once I did, I just fell in love with it. Put some water in each. Oh, look at that. That's pretty. Isn't it pretty? It looks so pretty. Oh. It's an excess. Now watch, look. That's, they, they put those designs on shirts. They, this I is know. what they call tie-dyed on shirts. You're right. Let me see if I can get this open, but look. That's so pretty. So when you leave it there to dry, it'll come put, out perfect. It's going to be just beautiful. Then we'll hang these up outside like we hang everything that we do. Isn't that neat? Yeah. Yes. Like, like, I was told I on Friday, and I was in the morning and stuff like that, so I had to continue with my routine. And then over the weekend is when it's like, oh my gosh. And so the girl who nominated me, I gave her a call and I said, I won this award. And she goes, I know, I wrote the letter for you. So, and she goes, she said she loved doing it. So, oh, sorry. She said I, she loved doing it. You know, she was so pleased to write the letter because I've made a huge impact in her life. She's 21 years old right now. She's 21. I keep in touch with her. She'll give me a call every now and then to see how I'm doing. She does have siblings here at this school, so, you know, we keep in touch that way, too. So it's a, the student you had a while back I want to, is, My second year teaching is what right. remembers the effect you've had on Yep, it. sure has. And, so that must make you feel good all in itself. Yes, it does. It really does. I was pleasantly shocked, but, it was, I mean, she's a sweet girl, just truly a sweet girl. Now, imagine that was your part. What would you do if you were there? Just think about it, okay? Let's she talked now. about how we take pictures in class, and I put like a photo album for her together, a photo album together for her, and like basically all the kids of the different field trips we did, the stuff we did here at school. And so she talked about that. She talked about how, um, like things that I did for her, like when they needed stuff, I would buy things and give it to her and her family. And um, just how much she enjoyed being in the class. So you look at being a teacher or being a kid, is it more than just teaching? How it's more than teaching. It's, it is. It is. How so? Well, it's, you're kind of like their parent. You help take care of all their needs. They come to school. If they don't have something, you give it to them. If they're hungry, you get them some food, things like that. If they, they need clothes, you can find a way to get it for them. So that's, that's what my role is here. She cares more just in teaching and learning. She cares about the individual students, and she shows it. She, she goes out of her way. She's here early in the morning, she's late in the afternoon, making house visits. Whatever it takes for a child to succeed, she does. And it, it just goes to show she, you know, after what, 15, 16 years, she hasn't changed. She still cares about the individual. She takes it to heart. She treats them all like they're her children, and uh, she just wants them to be happy, be successful. And in this business, with the population we serve, you have to care about the children. You have to get warm, warm them over, realize that they're safe here, and that you really cares. And that's when children start to learn. Who can raise their hand and answer number two for me? Raise I love this school. I love the administrative staff here, and I love these kids that I teach. As long as I can have a job teaching, I'll continue to do it.